It is week eight of the high school football season, and with so many great teams in Region 4, it's so fun to watch those powerhouse teams go at it. Yeah, tonight's powerhouse matchup, undefeated Sky Ridge at 6-1 and one Lone Peak. Falcons try to go to 8-0 on the year, but they were down 16-7 when McKay Hillstead hits Makafainga. It's 16-14. Next possession for Sky Ridge. Hillstead goes to the end zone again, but Cal Hansen comes down with the interception. He loses it, bats it back to himself for the touchback. Lone Peak taking over in the second half. Jackson Willits gets the carry, plows through a defender, 14-yard touchdown run, and then later, it's Willits again. He goes in from four yards out, and Lone Peak hands Sky Ridge's first loss of the year, the final 37-20, Willits two touchdown runs for the Knights. Big time rivalry game between American Fork and Pleasant Grove. Late in the first quarter for the Vikings, Dave Britton's throw, just a little off. Watch Lewis comes up with a diving interception for the Cavemen. Later in the second quarter, Sam Levitt throws it right to Brendan Bourgeois, and he returns it 21 yards for the touchdown. So made bougie. It 10, one, nothing Cavemen, PG gets it back. Levitt is going to heave this thing. Darius Clemens makes the catch for a huge gain inside the 30. Then it's Levitt to Winterton, who just is going to get across the goal line for the score. But American Fork comes away with the victory in this one. Final 41-20. Maddox Matson, two touchdown passes. The Cavemen scored three defensive touchdowns tonight. Wow. Corner Canyon trying to make it 34 straight wins. Chargers hosting Westlake. Look out. This one went as expected. Quarterback Jackson Dart steps up in the pocket. It's Noah Kerr. 22-yard touchdown. Chargers off and running. Next possession, Dart. Throwing darts all day to throw it. Pull up a chair, <laughs> why don't you? It's Cody Hagen for a 37-yard pickup. That sets up another touchdown pass from Dart to Noah Kerr. Everyone cares about this team. 17-yard touchdown and Corner Canyon rolls again. Final score, 56-17. Five TD passes for Dart, three to Noah Kerr. Big game in Region 1. Davis High hosting Weber. And early on, it was all Warriors. Dawes. Tree. Yeah, Tree brushed through. Chops down, chance for Hill for the sack. Then for Hill looking for the end zone. But Johnny McKinney is going to make the leaping catch for the interception. Nice pick right Ooh. there. Weaver takes over, and the Warriors go to work on offense. Quarterback Jake Lindsay finds Cannon DeVries. He busts the tackle. He's going to go 55 yards for the touchdown. Weaver up 24-7 at the half. They hold on to win a final 32-26. Lindsay with a couple of touchdown passes and a touchdown run. Both Riverton and Bingham coming off dramatic last second victories last week. The Silver Wolves take the lead. It's fourth and 10. They go for it. Colby Barton to Josh Jacobson. 30 yard touchdown. 10 0 Riverton. Bingham scores two touchdowns, though, to take the lead back. Quarterback Troy Main to Isaiah Glasker. Great catch in the corner of the end zone. 14 13 Bingham. Third quarter. Riverton back on top as Barton hits Jackson Bennett. Oh, look at this catch. 29 yard score. Sweet. Bingham down three. They're at the one yard line. About two minutes to play. And they fumble oh, it. Oh. Dax Hansen pounces on it for Riverton and the Silver Wolves. Hold on, the final 20 to 17. Colby Barton, two touchdown passes for the Silver Wolves.